the Scottish Workplace Journey Challenge is underway at the moment. It's a really fun challenge for workplaces across all of Scotland and the aim is to encourage people to choose more active and sustainable modes of travel. I'm taking part as one of the teams for NHS Grampian, so I thought I'd challenge myself by doing something I've never done before, which is take my bike on the train. So tomorrow I'm traveling from Aberdeen up to Inverness for a cycle leader course. Obviously I need to take my bike with me. Normally I would have just stuck on the back of the car and driven up, but I'm trying to choose more sustainable ways to travel and also I really want to win this challenge. It's 5.40 in the morning and as you can see, it's completely dark outside, um, but I've got my reflective gear on and I've got plenty of lights on my bike. Let's go. my train tickets directly through the ScotRail website. On the page with seat reservations you can add a bike reservation for no additional cost. Just remember to book your bike reservation for the return journey too. That's me arrived in Inverness. My course is at Inverness College which according to Google Maps is about a 14 minute cycle from here. I don't really know where I'm going, so wish me luck. The bike parking here is absolutely insane. That's me arrived in time for my course at the college. It was a really lovely journey. Getting my bike on and off the train was easy. Beautiful scenery on the way here. And even though I started my journey in the dark, I didn't even mind because I got some exercise in for the day. My total journey time was around three hours compared to two and a half hours in a car, so very similar. For my return journey, I saved £28.63 since my train ticket was far cheaper than petrol. I burned an extra 430 calories and I saved an incredible 38.76 kilograms of CO2, all simply by choosing a different way to travel. 